Hello, friends. Today I'm taking you on a walk around the Canadian Museum of History. It's Canada's national museum located in the city of Gatineau, province of Quebec, in the national capital region. It's within a short driving distance from my home. The Museum of History is directly across the Ottawa River from Parliament Hill in Ottawa. This museum used to be called by various names, including the Canadian Museum of Civilization, but changed its name to Canadian Museum of History in 2013. The museum looks gorgeous, and I always find new, interesting details in its surrounding grounds. Let's continue our refreshing walk. According to the Canadian Museum of History Act, as it's mentioned on their website, historymuseum.ca, museum mandate is to enhance Canadians' knowledge, understanding and appreciation of events, experiences, people and objects that reflect and have shaped Canada's history and identity, and also to enhance their awareness of world history and cultures. The Canadian Museum of History has over 1.2 million visitors each year. It's also one of Canada's oldest public institutions, with its roots stretching back to 1856. The Museum of History has outstanding exhibitions and even has a fantastic online database. The Canadian Museum of History has roughly 25,000 square meters of display space spread over four floors in its museum building. These buildings were designed by Douglas Cardinal, a famous Aboriginal architect educated at the University of British Columbia and the University of Texas at Austin. The museum complex consists of two wings, the public and curatorial wings, surrounded by a series of plazas connected by a grand staircase. The architect has a passion for unconventional forms and appreciation of nature and landscape. He developed his passion into the unique architectural style. I enjoy this area of my city and visit it a few times every year. The beauty of this museum keeps on taking my breath away. What a wonderful and uplifting area to go out for a walk. Today is a beautiful sunny day and I feel deep appreciation for a chance to walk outside, enjoy fresh and crisp air, absorb the view of the museum and its surrounding environment. Even though the museum is currently closed, I look forward to returning at a later time for its exhibitions. Meanwhile, it continues to bring joy into my life. If you visit the National Capital Region of Canada, consider spending some time exploring this area. As nice as it looks through the screen, it's worth feeling a spirit of Canada that lives here. Extra tip, this area is great for watching the fireworks on Canada Day. I hope you enjoyed this walk around the Canadian Museum of History. Please like and subscribe, it really helps my small channel. I'll see you next time.